Hi friends, how are you? This is the Call Donuts speaking, and welcome back to some more Death by Hole developer commentary. Oh my gosh, that was quite a big lag spike. Anyway, this is probably the last time the Death by Hole devcom takes a spot that's meant for Tech It Classic. Um, although I have not gotten the chance to farm up more UU matter uh, this week because I was really busy with school this past week. Um, However, summer is fast approaching, and Death by Whole Devcom will probably get its own day uh, this summer. Alright, so anyway, um, if you didn't see my last video, quick explanation of the week-long hiatus. Um, that was caused by the same heavy workload in school that prevented me from farming you, you matter. Um, but anyway, here I am, I'm back. Uh, we're going to be making videos again, or I'm going to be making videos for you again. And we're going to go try to finish up um, in the uh, Rushing Rivers today. So quick progress update on the map itself. I have not gotten a chance to build any more areas, although uh, the sixth area does have some stuff in it right now. It's in its very early stages, so I can't call it an area, really, um, to be honest. But that'll be coming soon. Anyway, let's jump back into Rushing Rivers. So if we go down the water path, which is probably one of the safer routes, to be honest. Alright, oh yeah, these guys have uh, thorns. Really, really annoying. These guys are pretty much tanks. Um, I want to block off the intersections, to be honest with you. Because uh, they're just going to cause problems. And I don't like those problems. Um... We need to try to block it off as best we can. Uh, gonna be kind of difficult. There we go. Sort of blocked it. Yeah, I don't think any super spiders can fall down now, so let's keep moving. Skelly spawner. Down. Okay. I should have made an iron pick. Oh, well. Um, we found some more iron gear. That's good. We have encountered the blazes. Not so good. Uh, but we can pretty easily deal with them. We can pour in some water, maybe? Alright, never mind. We'll have to do that later. Uh, the good news is, eventually... Um, Alright, we don't want to take that yet, because we might die. Um, but the good news is, eventually we're going to be able to get... Uh, oh gosh. Some... Uh, we're going to be able to get an enchanting table. That's what I meant to say. Uh, at some point here. Where are we? Are we at the edge of the uh, area? Oh shoot, lag spike. I think we are. I think we made it through. Whew. Okay. Ah, lag spike. Nope, there's more. Okay. Uh. Rushing Rivers is formidable, but it's not actually that long. Um, to be honest. Ah. There's a skelly up here, but he doesn't have any custom gear, so we'll be fine. Alright, now the areas converge at this point. Ah, uh, da 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 Okay. And we are actually into the major area, which is actually pretty small. Um, oh shoot, 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 shoot. We need to block this off so badly. Um, let's, let's dig ourselves a little hole to hide in. Alright, dig in, dig in, dig in. Light. Food. Alright, we cannot be attacked by anything but a skeleton now. Or a cave spider, but there are no cave spiders in this area. I know, because I made it. Um, anyway, let's see, how much cobble do we have right now? Sixteen. That's not too bad. Uh, alright. There are a lot of mobs back there. Pulling the wool out of this place is going to be a challenge. Um, yeah, this is going to be bad. Let's put it that way. Um, and we're probably letting a whole bunch of mobs spawn right now. I actually don't remember how many spawners there are in this area, but I don't think it's very many. Um, so that's, or at least not in the second part of the area, that is. So that's a good sign. Um, I'd like to block off the previous section now and uh, create a little safe haven for us, but that's going to be a little easier said than done when we have a giant horde of monsters trying to come kill us. 
Alright. I think we blocked the whole thing off. Which is good. There are a heck of a lot of super spiders back there. Ah, get inside, get inside, get inside. Okay. Okay, we're good, we're good. We have Maelstrom, which is good. Ah, nope, thorns are gonna kill us, right? I gotta, I gotta heal up. Let's eat this chicken and heal for a moment. Let's drop this out of our inventory. Here we go. Six attack damage versus seven and a half. Okay. Let's keep this on the bar so we can at least potentially heal up. Ah, thorns. Dang it. Why did I give those guys thorns? Ah, uh, this is really bad. Alright. Well, um... Yeah, that's a really bad idea. Um, to punch them. We're gonna try to crit these guys as best we can. It's not gonna be that easy. We killed one, alright. Let's try to get some light out there. Ah, no. Oh my gosh, that was close. Uh, I can't shoot them with my bow either at this low light. So we're just gonna sit here and heal up for a moment. Um, we are pretty much at the end of Rushing River. Um, but not quite all the way through. So this is going to be difficult, considering how many of these guys there are. Alright, we're going to dig under them. Actually, no, we're going to dig around them. Better idea. Alright, what's over here? We can get a look at the area. We can see there's a fleecy box and a whole lot of spiders over there. Um, there's also a whole lot of them over here. Now what I'd like to do... You're kidding me. Is get out of here. And away from all the spiders. Because there are just way too many of them. And to be honest, they are pretty much the dominant mob of the area. Um, they weren't intended to be, but they are. Uh, frankly. Yeah, we are definitely not dealing with those guys. Um... Ooh. Roof spawner? Must be a roof spawner. Hmm. Because one just fell down. Or maybe he climbed up a wall? I don't know. Ooh, gas. Okay, there's a gas back there. Not that I didn't know that, but... Oh, well. Um... There is a chest, so let's go to the chest. Um, for now. And hopefully not spawn a ghast. Yeah, but I, I am not going down there into a horde of mobs with thorns. Um, like, if they didn't have thorns, it would probably be fine. But they have thorns, and that's just flat-out ridiculous. Um, like, I'm not dealing with that. Note to self, rebalance the map so that I can't just tunnel into the wool. Um, and or, uh, you know, have spiders with thorns. Alright, where is this chest? Okay, here it is. What is in this? I don't even remember, to be honest. Um, I made this such a long time ago. Can't read the sign. What does it say? What could you do with these? Um, what can I do with these? I don't know, because I, uh, haven't opened the chest. TNT and fire charges. I'm smart. I probably should not have given my, uh, myself these, to be honest. Um, alright. Let's see, we're going to combine the picks now. 26 plus 23 equals 55, because Minecraft can do math. Um, Alright, we're going to tunnel down, to be honest. Uh, this is way too dangerous going that way. Uh, we're also going to create a blockage in the middle to make sure nothing comes in. We'll also light that up to try to prevent spawns as much as possible. Alright, so we're going in from the top which is the standard CTM procedure, more or less. Um, we're gonna go too wide so we don't... Ah! Ah! Ugh! Oh, phew! We're going too wide so we don't kill ourselves in the process. Ah! Uh, okay. Uh, we're, we're gonna go down in this fashion. And we're gonna see if we can dig straight down here. Okay. We're still not there. So we need to dig over a little bit and then dig down. I am now stuck in this uh, place. Not good. 
All right, let's let's punch our way down uh, and see where we are. All right, let's punch out now. Where are we? This is pretty important. We are right above the wall. The wall is gonna be like right here, pretty much. Um. Uh, where is the gosh darn thing? I put it in here. Oh, is it right there? Where did I put the thing? Oh, it's down there. It's down. Okay. We are right above the wall. We're gonna drop some cobble back there. I'll leave a light for you guys so you can see. But we're just gonna go around the whole dungeon this time, because the super spiders are a little too much to ask for. Yeah, so I will definitely be rebalancing this area a little bit, both to uh, prevent tunneling and... Um, oh, there we go. There's the brick. Both to prevent tunneling and to make it a little less intense. Because this area was way too crazy for intersection one. Not even like the blazes and this stuff. The stuff out here will be fine. Those spiders are insanity. Alright, oh, you beat another one. Light blue wool. We're getting out of here. Um, and not coming back. So let's hop up. We're getting out of here now. Um, grab the torch. And let's get out. That was intense. Okay. Uh, we got the wool. Not as legitimately as I would like to have gotten it, because um, it doesn't allow me to playtest the actual area. Um, it just allows me to practice my tunneling strategies, but oh well. Um, tunnelers are a part of the CTM playing community, so it's important to know how they would react to a situation like this and how easily they could beat an area. There is a skeleton right there. I'm very concerned about him. Two, actually, but one was much closer. Alright, I think we're okay. I don't think we're gonna have any trouble getting back, at least to the entry point here. Um, but beyond that, I got no idea. Cause these spiders are crazy. Crazy insane. Alright, let's light the whole place up. Um, there are so many of them right there. We gotta get inside a one by one hole. We're doing that. Alright, and we're gonna punch our way through. Because I really would rather not deal with the spiders. Alright, so we're going to get through here. And we're going to try to bring the wool back safely. But there is lava. So it's very important that we are careful in this endeavor. Um, oh gosh. See, this is where the rushed approach hurts you. Die, 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 die. Okay. Let's punch him back. Ah! There's a creeper spawner right above us, isn't there? Dang it. Alright, let's try to break through before we get too many mobs on us. Alright. Come on. We made it. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Move, move, move. Go, 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 move. Go, 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 move. Hop, 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 hop. Up, 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 up. Get out of here! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! That's where the creeper spawner is, I suppose. Alright. Let's get out of here! Oh my gosh! That was close. We almost just burned in lava with the wall. I guess I could have quickly, um. I guess I could have quickly thrown the, uh, wool into the water or something. Oh, I just realized something, guys. We're gonna have to come back. I don't think we found the scuba gear last episode. Um, I think it's somewhere in the lava section, so we'll come back for that. Um, nope, we're not going that way. We're going this way. We're going this way. Oh, was this all lava before? Yeah, the ice probably melted and poured over it. That's actually a good thing for us. Um, now can we get out of here? Please? Alright, here's the water. I'm betting the scuba gear is somewhere down there. Um, but we need that, if you don't remember, guys, to get through, uh, whatever it's called, um, Mayan Cenote, uh, cause it's basically a giant lake at the start. 
All right. Anyway, though, we made it. We're free. Whew. We got it. All right. Wool dropped off. Ooh, we did get the flippers. Thank goodness. Um, I don't have to go back in there ever again. All right. We are blocking this thing off for good. Forget that. Oh my gosh. All right. Well, how much coal do I have? All right. I can make, um, oh, I have to make a bucket. That's right. All right. So we're going to make a bucket first. Um, that's done. Now we need to drop off this stuff. I don't think we need the TNT right now. Uh, though, don't quote me on that. Um, ooh, we could farm. Let's farm. That's a smart plan. We need some food. Carrots are the only farmable option right now. Uh, so let's make a little base. Oh, I need a pick. Uh, pick. Actually, I didn't need that wood. I have, um, some stone right here. There we go. There's another stone pick. And we're going to dig up some terrain right here and make a little farm area for some carrots. All right. Sound good? Great. Uh, let's make this the center of an infinite source, too. All right. Here we go. So let's find some water. Um, we can't go that way. Guess we're grabbing it from here. Gosh, I really don't want to stay here for long. Rushing Rivers is a little too intense. Note to self, gotta rebalance that thing. Um, but that's okay. Um, it's it's a very early version of the map, as I said before. So, uh, balancing will come later. Or balance, I should say. Balancing is coming now. Anyway, let's put down some dirt. So now we can take from this, no problem. I'm gonna put a slab right here so I don't actually uh, accidentally take from that one there we are and then we need a hoe so let's make um, some of this into sticks I'm gonna make a hoe here boom time to farm oh yeah all right so let's turn this into farmland there we go and where are the carrots or carrot here we go we're going to farm this, solve our food problem as best we can. A potato would probably be better, but I, don't, but I don't think I have one of those. So we're going with what we've got and planting some carrots. All right, six, that's good. Eight, nice. See how many we can get out of this whole process. Right, we're up to nine. Fourteen. Thirteen. Fifteen. All right, and we'll bone meal that last one. Okay. So we have thirteen carrots on us. We're going to see how long these last us. Um, we'll use them as a supplementary food source to this pumpkin pie. Uh, we'll dump some of the stuff we don't need. Make a few more torches quickly. There's a creeper over there that I really don't want to deal with. Anyway, uh, we've pretty much got everything we need uh, to succeed here. We need to make one more pick, I think, though, so we'll do that. And then I think we're going to be ready for reflection, which is not a pleasant area, to be honest. Um, it's kind of gimmicky, so it's not actually that tough to defeat. Oh, wait, I need the water bucket. But it's still not pleasant. Um, there's a lot of risk involved and a lot of luck. So I'm not thrilled to have to go in there. Uh, I have beaten the area before, but that was uh, in an earlier version of the map where some of the mobs didn't work. So it should be considerably more difficult now. Anyway, let's grab a few more blocks, and then we're going to take a quick peek. We might not have time to beat the area today, but we're going to give it our best shot. Um... All right, let's light the thing up, and let's head in. So, bonus challenge we've talked about before. We grab this ingot. Uh, there is a chest up here that we'll build up to now. All right, we're up to it basically here. So let's just build 
an additional portion of the staircase here. A little bit risky to have a jump involved here, but hey, that's all right. Torch going down. Have you thanked me yet? Uh, we actually have to break this. Two iron. Boom. We don't actually want this right now because we're probably just going to lose it in the upcoming dungeon. So we're going to drop it off. I also just realized we left the iron armor in this dungeon. So we're going to have to go back and grab that. Um, I really did not want to come back in here. But before we hit reflection, we need to go and... Uh, grab the loot from back here to create a backup set of gear, which is a fairly important thing. Uh, is it here that we got the extra set? No. It's on the other side, isn't it? Uh, is it this one? Is this the extra set? Yes. Alright, let's grab this and go away. Ah! Get out, get out, get out, get out. Let's get out of here. I did not do a very good job with this thing. Um, I guess I can take a few blocks from it now. I don't know. Not really worth the time, I suppose, to steal those blocks. Oh well. Alright, we'll seal it off, just for good measure. I think all the areas are sealed off, but we're sealing this part too. I really don't want to ever come back there. Um, anyway, let's drop off the extra gear. So we have a backup set now uh, to get our stuff with. And let's grab a few more blocks because we're going to need them. I don't think I grabbed a sapling last, ep last episode, did I? Nope. Alright, let's do that now. Let's head over to that tree we just got the chest from. And we're going to get ourselves a sapling. So we're coming in. I'm less concerned about the wood than I am about the sapling. Because we can set up our own little tree farm. Um, pretty soon here. Come on. Sapling. 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 Gosh darn it. Give me a sapling tree. Shoot, now I have to be really careful. Um. Because now I have to make sure I don't fall while trying to collect a sapling, which the game has refused to give me. There we go. Alright, now we've got a sapling. I'm pretty much unconcerned with the rest of the leaves on this tree, as long as we have one. Alright, two. That's awesome. We can afford to not get any from the next uh, tree, but there we are. We'll use Maelstrom just to save time, because we are trying to make some progress here. Uh... More wood is always good. Um, miss that uh, branch, but oh well. Uh, let's get back uh, over to the actual area. Now, what we need to do is not get killed and drop down to right there where there's a chest and, of course, a lower position. So, let's head over. We've got... Oh my gosh, that was close. Uh, we're not, we're not going to hit it if we get there. Uh, let's go right here. That should do. So let's drop. And we're going to need the source. Um, so once we see that it hits... Did it hit? Ah! Ah! Oh gosh. Did we hit it or did we miss? I don't think it's actually reached down that far yet. Did it go? I think it made it. I think it made it. So we're going to actually take our water back and drop down with this thing. My goodness, here we go. Alright, and we're pretty much safe here. Okay. So let's light the thing up. Much needed nourishment. This is a food one. We did kind of need this because we might be stranded down here for a little bit. Alright, so that's good. We've got some more food. Um, anyway. <coughs> Let's keep moving. So, we got the water back. This is going to gradually decay. There's some skellies over there, which is a minor concern, but isn't too bad. The big concern is the gas spawner, which I don't know if you can see, really. But it's over there, and it's a real problem. Alright. Is that going to hit it? It should hit the what is supposed to be the sun down there. Uh, I don't know. 
All right. Could we beat two areas in one episode? I highly doubt it. But we're gonna try, guys. All right. Let's head down there. Um, I'm tempted to take the water bucket back, but that would actually pretty much trap us down there. So we're just gonna try to jump down as fast as we can past the gas spawner. Yes! Is it still spinning? I don't think it's still spinning. Okay. Whew. Squids. Squids are now spawning. All right. Um... So now, basically, the whole side of this thing is obsidian. Not great. Uh, we need a block to stand on. And some more blocks. Okay. So what we need to do is get a little drop point. Uh, so we need to secure an area like this one, where we can drop in. And then what I'd like to do is pour water in on this thing. Because as you can see, there's a blaze spawner. Um... I'd really like to have a way out. Can this obsidian please break? Oh my gosh, this thing takes forever. I might not be able to break the obsidian. We'll see. Actually, there's a better way to do this. I, I know how you're supposed to do this. What you do is you place... Nope, not there. You place blocks like there. Like that. Yeah! There we go. That's how you do it. Okay. So there are already a ton of mobs in here. We're gonna get out. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. We're stuck. Okay. Break in. Break in and hide. Break in and hide. Break in and hide. Okay, block in. Okay. Ah! Ah! Alright. We're okay. We're okay. Uh, a little more hostile than the last time I came into this place. Um, didn't you hear about Icarus? Yeah, we've got the orange wool in here appropriately colored considering how much fires in here right now um all right so we have our escape point right there but it's pretty much useless right now um because effectively oh yay we're killing each other effectively um we're gonna get shot off no matter what we do oh no 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 I think I might need to pick up the wool just- I'll pick up one piece of wool to be safe. I don't want to take all three, but I'm concerned the chest is gonna blow up and the items with it if I don't take that. Um, alright, blocks there. I don't know what we're gonna do, guys. Uh, actually, I do know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna end the episode. So I hope you have enjoyed, guys. Please remember to like and subscribe if you did. This has been me called Donut speaking, and welcome back, and uh, not welcome back, uh, goodbye friends, we'll see you all next time, with some more death by whole death com. I don't really know how I'm gonna get out of this one, but we're gonna try, <laughs> oh gosh.